but well, it's not as far-fetched as it may seem. I'm out of breath, y'all. I had to bring all this stuff from the truck to the Airbnb. So, um, me and my best friend's sister rented out an Airbnb and her mom because uh, we're throwing her a bachelorette party. So, right now, her sister is taking her out for like a little day on the town, and I'm gonna be the one to decorate. So, let me just give you guys a little tour. So this is the kitchen. I know there's not like a lot of light. Guys, I don't have any time to turn the light on right now. That's the living room area. Isn't it so beautiful? It's just like the picture. This is the deck area where we have a little fire pit thing that we can do. And I'll show you guys what the door looks like. That's the door. It's stairs, so I gotta bring all this stuff up the stairs, guys. That's the little like welcome sign that you see when you come in. I'll show you the bedrooms. Well, this is the bathroom. This is the master bathroom. Um, this is one of the bedrooms. So, as you can see, I'll be staying in here too. Uh, this is another bedroom. It looks like it's um, a full size bed, maybe. And then, let me show you the queen's room. This is going to be. The room that I'm gonna decorate for their beautiful bride to be, my best friend Michelle. And she has her own bathroom, so she could get beautified in here and nobody will bother her. But yeah, guys, what do you guys think so far? The lighting everywhere is like so beautiful. Okay, look at this. Literally. I love Coco. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek. Um, in a few of me decorating once I get everything upstairs. I have asthma, so if I sound like Fat Albert, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm tired. Oh, y'all, I had to speed to do this, but let me give y'all a sneak peek of what I did. Sorry if it's not focusing. She's gonna be here any minute now, so let me hurry up and show you guys. So, this is the table. No, it's not focusing. Oh, almost tripped over a balloon, y'all. Put all the little treats on there, bridesmaids bags, brides bag, balloon. I got like wine, prosecco, stuff to mix drinks later, non-alcoholic alcoholic beverages for, for people who don't drink. This is the picture wall where she'll be taking a picture. Isn't that cute? This is the Manny Petty station that I set up with the itinerary for the weekend. And then down here, we have flower petals. This light doesn't work, ghetto. Oh, it works, okay, I lied. So, flower petals leading to her room, and I set that up, and yeah. Whew, that's basically it. I wish I could get the reaction of the bride, but you know, all people do not wanna be on camera. So let me just close the doors that don't make sense, so it can look even. Guys, I look like a MAC makeup artist, do I not? I just love black, it's like so chic, I don't know. All right guys, so I'll let you guys know how everything went after the weekend. Good to see. All right guys, so this is a table that I had set up um, in the dining room. As you can see, I have all the party stuff on there. So just to name a few places, uh, the bride bag I got at TJ Maxx. The two baskets that were next to it, I got that from the Christmas tree shop. I did order some cupcakes that you see on the table, if you can see that. <laughs> I got those from a local bakery. And then most of the decorations that you see that are on the table, including the tablecloth, are from A, Party City, and B, the Dollar Tree. There are a lot of great finds that you could get at those two stores for an affordable price. And then a lot of the goodies that were in the three baskets were from the Christmas Tree Shop as well as Burlington Coat Factory. 
in those places, guys, you could find any and everything. So I would actually start at those two places. You'd be surprised at what you find. All right, guys. So the balloons, the she said yes balloons and the rose petals, these I actually got from Party City. And don't forget, guys, they have coupons online. So you can literally get a coupon online and get a certain percentage off your order if you spend a certain amount. So please do not leave the party our party city out. All right, guys, so the backdrop I made, I used balloons that I got from Amazon as well as Joanne Fabrics. And to put the balloon arch together, I used fishing line, like the plastic fishing line. Uh, the gold backdrop that you see right there, that frilly stuff, I got that from Party City. And then the pop champagne, she's changing her last name, uh, that came in the kit that I bought from Amazon. And the backdrop behind it, uh, that little curtain with the leaves. I also got that from Party City. And the props that you see there, that also came from um, the Amazon kit that I bought. And one last thing, it's not pictured here, but I did buy some props for us to use to take pictures in front of this. So I'll insert a picture of what uh, the props look like. It's really cute. So I also wanted to create a little drink station. So those two plastic bowls, I did get those from Party City. The Bachelorette Bash glasses you see there, I got those from the Dollar Tree. And then the little colorful straws, the pink straws, I got those also from the Dollar Tree. And then the cup that they were in is from Party City. And then of course, you know, the alcohol, you could find that at any um, liquor store. All right, so this was a cute little Manny and Petty station. Everything you see here, guys, I got from the Dollar Store with the exception of the chalkboard and the... The jar that held the cotton, the jar, I got that from Burlington Coat Factory. And then from the Manny Petty Station was the hallway leading to the bride's room uh, with flower petals that I did get from the Party City. Uh, you could also find these flower petals at the dollar store, I believe, but at the time, my dollar store did not have this. Okay, so the bride letters that you see above the headboard, I got that in an Amazon kit, as well as that pink ring. And then the latex balloons were from uh, Party City. All right, guys, so this was the breakfast table that we decorated for the next day, well, the brunch table. The tablecloth was from Party City. The stemless flutes that you see there, that's from the Dollar Tree. I also made some chocolate covered strawberries. And then the two, I, I forgot what you call them. I think they're like tumblers for mimosa stuff. I got those from Party City. So if you're looking for those, I think they're called carafes. Yeah, you could get that at the Party City and they were plastic. Uh, most of the cups I got from Party City and the plates. And yeah, and Groceries, obviously, from any grocery store, you could find that. And then um, I would say the tea set. Yes, that tea set that you see there. I got that from Burlington Coat Factory for a really good price. And last but not least, guys, do not forget to check out Walmart because they also have bridal decorations. And that is all, guys. Thanks for watching my video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And if you have any questions, please leave it in the comment section below. Bye.